Some of the best athletes from around the world are in Tokyo for the Olympics, and one is from right here at home. NBC 26's Ben Boken is live in Nina, where a watch party is just wrapping up. And Ben, what are the emotions in that room right now? Yeah, John, Nina, today friends and family members came out to downtown Nina to support a local Olympian who was born and raised in the Fox Valley. And tonight, just about an hour ago, they got to see her participate in her first ever Olympic heat. She was a soccer kid and a cross country kid and did track and was never like the best kid on the team, but always a good athlete. Now one Nina native is one of the most elite athletes in the world. Even doing show choir or something that just kind of gave her some toughness. Born and raised in the Fox Valley, Maddie Wanamaker is currently in Tokyo as a member of the women's four rowing team. Dozens of friends and family members gathered in downtown Nina at Green's Poor House to watch Maddie's first heat. The whole community has been really great just supporting her and um, and, you know, letting them know how much they care about her and I'm really proud of her. We all are. Maddie's mother, Janet, says her daughter beat the odds on her way to the Olympics. She's like a Wisconsin public school kid who, you know, went to our state university and is on the same level with all these other people who maybe had different um, different opportunities along the way. So it's, it's pretty cool. Maddie Wanamaker didn't start rowing until she walked on her college team. I had a feeling it might be her sport, and so I like to be like, got that one right. <laughs> Though her team didn't secure first place on Friday night, the Nina community is proud. It is kind of a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and you never know if you're going to get it again. She's come through a lot, um, definitely gone through a trial, and I think we've got the best, the best crew out there right now to go and compete. Now, because Maddie and Team USA did not get first or second place in their heat tonight, they'll have one more chance to make it to the final this Sunday. Live here in downtown Nina, Ben Boken, NBC 26.